got uh, looks like piece size hail coming down and um, I just caught it as I came into town so I'm actually going to uh, wait this out I'm not relatively quickly um, you know when I say that maybe an hour but we'll see what we see um, I'm not going to and it's turned to it's turned to rain again but when I started the video is coming down hail, so that, that's that's what changes between three minutes you go know, from hail, pea-sized hail, to raindrops again. Uh, I checked on the weather app before I started the video, and it said 53 degrees. Um, the car is not as informative. A rental, so. but uh, now you got the weather uh, weather band, and um, let me see, change it around. Official uh, time frame. Um, just supposed to meet a friend, so um, you know, it's just too bad. I'm not. I'm too experienced of a driver to risk uh, make a stupid decision. Uh, just uh, try to. meet someone else's expectations. 
however long a trip takes is whatever it takes. And that's all there is to it. So, that being said, could just rain out and fizzle. Or, well, I looked at the weather app and it has an interesting feature. It shows you the number of lightning strikes in your area during a, you know, something like this. And it was lit up uh, more than a Christmas tree. Uh, I would say more like the Empire State Building. So I uh, just decided to hang out for a minute and, um, you know, keep my head on a swivel, so to speak, just look out for whatever changes, but, you know, thankfully, I did make it um, to a small area before it got um, you know, to come down, because when you're traveling, you're losing your traction on the road, first of all, <laughs> okay, so you're going to be needing to go slower, which no one seems to understand, they seem that uh, the weather's bad, so they want to hurry up and get out of it, well, if you hurry up and get in a crash, then that's what will happen, um, you got to go slower, you got to use your head, not your your impulses or what you know whatever you want to call that it's not it's not logical um and then uh basically yeah i don't know if it's gonna turn back to hail or if it's gonna be you know high wind this is a very light vehicle you know it's it's designed for uh fuel efficiency and um you know, put some miles on it, you know, just a rental, try and take care of it and all that good stuff. Um, you know, I don't abuse someone else's property, uh, believe it or not, I have consideration. Um, but... People on the road, you know, they're, they're as hazardous as anything out, as, as hazardous as the weather is, you know. Uh, I hadn't been on too many road trips in a, in a small car um, in quite a while, and I was realizing that, you know, the amount of people that will tailgate you and uh, you know, try and get you to drive above the speed limit. I mean, th these people were just acting literally insane. I had to, I had to call the, uh, you know, 911 dispatch today on a driver who was swerving from the, the right um, and a couple feet over over the white line, and then they would be swerving a few feet back, and I would follow them for about an hour. And since we were pretty much in a very remote area, there was one town they could have popped him at. Um, you know, he got away, and he was just swerving all that entire time. He was, and not only that, but he was driving about. 10, um, 10 to 15 miles above the speed limit, you know, he's just, he's hard to, I, I wasn't looking to, you know, it just, you know, it, it bothered me, it really, because, you know, that's the, that's the uh, SOB that's going to take somebody out, and, you know, it's just a matter of time, because they, they doing that, you know, and then it catches up. So, anyway, um, 
I am actually seeing the skies clear as we speak. So that is quite interesting. But, um, gotta check up on it. Um, certainly, it's just turned a very light rain. And, uh, you know, you can actually see the sky clear right there. When I started, it looked like the apocalypse. <laughs> uh, not an exaggeration. Behind me, it's wicked looking. <laughs> um, but, let me see. Behind me. gray and um, just uh, quick moving like I said so, um, you know it may be safe to continue now I've only been uh, pulled over you know 15 minutes so during that period of time you know you've seen the change in front of your eyes and I've recorded it for you so um, you know, let this be uh, a lesson to uh, maybe to some people who are thinking about traveling through, um, say, the Midwest or uh, you know, the heartland of the country. Uh, you know, during this time of year, uh, being early May, uh, it, uh, these severe storms pop up between the cold air from Canada and the warmer air from the south. So, um, anyway, all right, well, have a good day, and um, catch you later. Bye.